Welcome to this tutorial in which we're going to texture, light, and render this corridor. And as I'm sure you're aware, the corridor itself was created in a previous tutorial using Boolean modeling. And the emphasis in this training is going to be on working as quickly and efficiently as possible. And that means that we're not going to be using UV maps. All of our texturing is going to be done using projections. But if you do need to export these assets to other applications or to a game engine, then I'll show you how you can bake down all of your textures at the end of the process using a really quick Atlas unwrap. And before we proceed any further, I think it's important to explain the rationale behind this approach. I have other tutorials which show you how to UV map and texture hero assets. For example, I have the Modo Texturing Masterclass, and I also have the Vintage Motorcycle Texturing in Modo Training. And both of these will show you how to create really detailed bespoke textures on assets that have been properly UV mapped. But there are times when that approach simply isn't appropriate. And I think this scene is a case in point because it's a relatively detailed environment and it simply wouldn't be practical to painstakingly UV map every single mesh in this scene and to then create bespoke textures on every single asset. With a scene like this, it makes a lot of sense to take a much more pragmatic approach because it means that you'll be able to achieve your final result much more quickly. And in the final section of the tutorial, I will show you how you can completely relight your scene in post using either the free compositor within DaVinci Resolve or with Photoshop. So if you want to improve your efficiency when lighting and texturing in Modo, join me in this tutorial. 